exploring, understanding, and celebrating the natural world of the San Francisco Bay Area. Bay Nature on the Air. California has a wealth of different species of snakes. The western rattlesnake is by far the most widespread of the rattlesnakes throughout North America. Snakes are beneficial. They uh, exercise control over rodent populations. But besides that, they're just cool. Well, this is a perfect place for their habernaculum, a place where they hibernate. I suspect some of these animals are gonna start emerging pretty soon to warm themselves up. This one right here just molted. So not only do we get to see him, but we get to see his freshly molted skin right there. Every time they molt, by the way, they add a rattle. But the rattles fall off, so the number of rattles is not a good way to measure the age of a rattlesnake. That doesn't work. This is a pretty good specimen right here. Um, he's very thick bodied. You can see the, the triangular shaped head. And of course, the, the characteristic tail, which has the rattle. The rattle is an interesting bit of physiology on these guys. It's the only snake in the world, the rattlesnakes, that actually have a warning mechanism for letting you know they're in the neighborhood. These are a member of a group called the pit vipers. They're only found in the New World. And the word pit comes from the fact that right, right here, right below their eyes, they have little pits which are sensitive to infrared radiation. They feel the heat emanating from their prey, which are mostly vertebrates, warm-blooded vertebrates. They'll go out and find a warm-blooded prey item like a brush rabbit or a rodent of some kind. Larger animals usually aren't taken. Mostly hunting at night, um, although in the daytime too, depending on the temperature. They'll strike, they'll inject a measured amount of venom, and then they'll wait. And they'll wait till the animal dies, and then they will go and eat them. Unfortunately, snakes have gotten a, a bad rap, and they are not to be persecuted. They're to be protected. And California is blessed in having a rich variety of habitats. So we have one of the richest snake faunas in, in the United States. And they should, if you see a snake, just let it go its way and it will let you go your way.